Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back. Picked up right where we left off last time. Didn't do anything in between. Just finished up a live stream a minute ago, right before I started this uh, episode. Had time to eat dinner, and boom, back to uh, seven days to die. <laughs> Somehow I get that question at least once a stream. Uh, don't you ever get bored of playing seven days to die? I can't get enough of it. I cannot get enough of this silly game. I'll just play it and play it and play it. And uh, as soon as I get through playing it, I'll play it some more. So, uh, welcome back. If you have not, I uh, appreciate all your support on the streams uh, this weekend and always. And if you have not had a chance to uh, stop by and say hi on a live stream, I encourage you to do so. Uh, get in there so I can talk to you live. And, uh, and thank you for your support. Uh, I don't know what happened here. We have another one of those little boo-boos where this is not working out for me here. It keeps falling in, and I don't understand why. I don't know what it is. It's something to do with me working underneath, possibly. You know, we filled in that hallway down there. It was down below. Thankfully, we finally got that finished. Um, I need to get some business glass and fill in the one block over here. That I have not uh, filled in quite yet. and uh, But yeah, we had a great time this weekend on, on the stream series. Uh, the base over there is certainly coming together. I don't know why it looks like there's a divider right there. That's kind of odd. Something to do with the shadows. Oh, look at that. We can go in right there. At some point, though, uh, I'm going to have to make an exit right here that I can go out. Uh, and get outside, you know, so I can get outside right there. And I'm going to have to get all this painted and then get the shotgun turrets where they're going to go. Got to figure all that out. Uh, Draco is coming up with some creative ideas on hiding wiring. Uh, don't know yet. I, I don't know how I'm going to do the wiring. We'll kind of tackle that when we get to it. Thinking about making these things a different color. I didn't get any feedback from anyone. I don't know if you just skipped through that part of the episode or what, but I didn't get any feedback for what color these uh, plates on the side should be, if they should be white, if they should be blue. Uh, I kind of think I like the white on the bottom versus the blue, but I don't know. Blue matches everything. Uh, but anyway, anyway, uh, we'll, we'll get back to painting at some point again sometime soon. Right now, I'm going to stick my paint tool up in here. Ooh, that's an ugly number right there. Let's, let's do that like that. There we go. All right. Uh, club on my belt, just in case. And stone. Hope you all have enjoyed the fact that I have not had to do any mining in a while. Uh, we did a good bit of mining at some point. And that has held me over. Oh, yeah, so it looks differently with the uh, lighting on there. But that's held me over. And uh, last episode, we were able to accomplish the corners. We got the corners done. I like those. I don't know what you all think about them. But uh, I think they are beautiful, marvelous. And, um, you know, it matches this, matches that. You know what I mean? Like, if you look at it from above... Uh, it's all kind of uh, uniform now. It all looks like it should go together. Uh, but we have two more hallways to do. Now, what stinks about this is that the entrance we have goes over uh, the bridge or the hallway is going to go over that, that entrance. I don't know how it's going to work out block-wise. But we might encounter the same thing we encountered here where the blocks are going to fall in and all kinds of silliness if I build it over that. Now, uh, this building here is going to be somewhat of an entrance building for me, I've decided. I uh, decided that about a week ago or so. Uh, so i got to figure out what I'm going to do with it. We're going to have to move it around. Let me go ahead and take that out and stick it up in here. I don't need all that concrete on us. And bulletproof glass. What are we doing for bulletproof glass? Well, we have these, but I need more of those blocks. Bulletproof glass block. How many of those can we make? 75? Let's just make them all. Uh, what does that bring us down to in glass and lead? Once we get the glass and lead uh, picked up, then we're, we're okay again. We can make a little bit more. Uh, 31 minutes on that. All right. I can pick this up. 
for a, I don't think I'm going to need it. I don't think I'm going to put this down anywhere. We'll keep it. We'll keep it. But I think we're just going to... We're just going to move it on out of this room. And over to the other forge room. And I kind of need to decide what I'm going to do in this other forge room as far as the... <sighs> all of this goes. I like the three there. Um, now we could do like a storage, storage, storage. You know what I'm saying? Like a storage there, storage there, storage there. I mean, same thing here. Make a little L-shaped storage. I don't know if we're really going to need all that storage. It more be for looks than it would be for, uh, you know, storage that we need. But I almost think it would look better. It's almost a shame that I have this block right here. I can put three storage there. Uh, we'll eventually have to pick up our land claim block. Well, let me stick this cement mixer up in there. Up in there. And uh, I need to take all the lighting down, too, at some point, because that's not going to be that way. But I like that little light right there. Look at this. We can turn our mining helmet off and you just see just beautifully up in here. No need for a uh, mining helmet in our forge room. Uh, any longer if it works out like this. Let me check my graphics settings here. Everything's on. Everything's on. All the shadows and reflections and all that fancy, the fancy frills and stuff. Um, so, I say today, uh, we can work on the detail work like that forge room and the horde defense and all of that later. Uh, I say I get started on this new guard or uh, new hallway over here, and try to get that implemented into our build. Um, take the plates off. Hey, what? And we have 500 plates right here. Okay, I thought I was running low on those. So we need the hundred pillars. I can sell these hundred pillars next time we go to a trader. I can sell these and those to the trader. We don't need those anymore. Uh, make a little bit of cash, a little bit of cash. There's my one business glass plate right there. And I also need to make more of these. I'm almost out of those. Um, let's get in the workbench here. And arch. Let's make 200. Let's make 200 of those. Get over here with my... Oh, you know what? Before we leave, no need to run off so quickly. You can always drink some goldenrod tea, folks. Always drink some of that. Little man's always looking forward to a sip of that tasty beverage. But I do need to figure out how I'm going to do these hallways and these plates on the wall. How about that rotation? Oh, yeah. Complete. Last block. Last glass block. Nice. So I've been saying it, you know, if, if you watch the stream series, you keep up with that. Uh, get a lot of compliments on the base. Oh man, it looks so cool. But I think this base is better. I think this base is a lot better looking and uh, more style, not stylistic's not the word, but it just has uh, has a better feel to it, a better look to it, I think. Uh, so we need to plan this out. Uh, let me go ahead and close this down. And what do we do over there? We had a one, two, three. So these three blocks right here, exactly where we see the uh, shotgun hatches, are going to have to come out. They're going to have to come out. Uh, let me go ahead and repair my auger. i probably need to go get some more gas as well. Uh, one, two, three. No, he had me to reload already. Let me turn it down just a tad for you here while we auger this glass out. Take out these reinforced blocks. Something I didn't think to look into here. Okay, so it is an odd number. I was gonna make sure we didn't do this building an even number over here because it would the hallway wouldn't come in right. But that pillar you see right there. 
would be the odd number. So it's five across. So one, two, and that's the third, both directions. So that'll be the center block of our hallway over here. And I did go with the concrete corners right there, correct? Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Just like that. Put those in there. So we'll have to auger this, uh, these blocks out. Tell you what, let's auger the corner block out first. Uh, copy that rotation. No, that's not a, I can't copy that rotation. It's a different type of block. Is that right? Yeah, that's right. Right there. Yeah, the live streams have been excellent lately. And I tell you what, I was telling my business partner what makes them so great is that I can look down now. And you all have gotten to know each other so uh, well. And uh, welcome to all the newcomers uh, so warmly that when I look over at chat, uh, there's really not much for me to say to interact. You know, I just kind of do my thing because you all are talking to each other. And it's just a beautiful thing. Uh, seeing the community come together like that and uh, you all having fun just uh, uh, playing the games and talking it up. And I have some pretty cool things in mind moving forward for the stream. Uh, we just implement a little bit at a time. A little bit at a time. You know, I, this is all new to me still. I know I keep saying that, but uh, this whole, the streaming thing is all kind of new to me, and, uh, you know, I try to improve on it, uh, as much as I can, but you just have to do a little bit at a time, add this, try it out, add that, try it out, so forth and so on, and, uh, we'll have a nice, we'll have a nice little setup before too long. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven is where that first pillar is going to go right in the center there. Uh, make sure I'm center. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So that'll be the first pillar right there. Now, before I do anything and cut the first hole in the ground, I want to double check this. Make sure. I don't want to start making stuff concrete. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. And that's even has to change there. That's going to have to change because I have to change that bottom square block with a uh, with a pillar. Okay, so to make it even, do that. And then we're going to, how many up there are we going to go? Is it three? And then a solid block. Uh, it's actually going to be four. It's going to be four because of that, that solid block, I'm confusing that, but it should be a pillar. It should be four over there. So one, two, three. Three, four. Oh, and you all might get a surprise. You all might get a surprise. Uh, Giant Hermit and Old Crew Express have helped me add something to the game that I don't know how it's going to work out. Like, I, I don't know what's going to happen. But it should be pretty magnificent when it does happen. It's just a random event. Something that can randomly happen. And, uh... It's coming, folks. It's coming. It didn't happen on the stream today because it is just a random chance that it will happen. But uh, you might, you all might get to see it before anyone else if uh, if it comes on this Let's Play before it comes on a stream series. It'd be pretty comical if it does. You know, I need to build myself up there. I just kind of want to build this first little tier out and make sure I'm uh, spot on with, uh, yes, yes, I am. Oops. Oh, didn't mean to do that. All right, so now, now I have to plan this out. I have to do a little bit at one and a little bit at the other. A little bit of soul, get you right. Boo doo doo doo. Boo doo doo doo. Let's see, so the next thing was how far. I guess it's going to be different. This side. Um. It's going to be different than the other side because the other side over there already had a structure and this one did not. Uh, or wait a minute, though. Did we make that hallway the same length both ways? We may have. We may have. So it could be the same. So from this pillar, one, two, three, four, five, and then six. 
and then it goes back the other way. Let's see if it works out the same over here. I don't think it's going to. That's all right. That's all right. It'll look fine just from a distance or whatever. You'll never know it. So one, two, three, four, five, six. And then one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, I keep stepping on the cactus. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right. And I always double and triple measure things. Uh, Draco gives me such a hard time. But it's really because um, I, when I get to going, when I get to going, I just build, 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 build. And if it, was, if it turns out that it, it may have been wrong, then we have a lot of stuff to tear down because I don't look back. I don't look back. I, uh, I'll go from this side to the other side and just two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, so it'll, it'll kind of kind of double up there. Maybe we could split this difference. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Two, three, four, five would be half of that. Just split it right down the middle. I hear a zombie. Ah, here's me a zombie. But I don't see me as a zombie. Need to go over there and cut that tree farm down sometime soon. Maybe we take a break from this at some point today and, and do that. So that's beautiful. It'll work out perfectly here with this building as well. Uh, with uh, coming into the side of it. Let me uh, dig myself a hole. Down in a hole. Boo -doo -doo -doo. Really excited about the old uh, internet connection here. You know, I've been um, talking about the time that it takes me to upload episodes, and I'm able to upload this uh, 50, 55 gig episode now in a fraction of the time it took me to upload a 20 something gig episode. So it's, uh, it's really nice to be able to record in a higher quality now and to get that out to you all uh, much faster. Freeze me up so I can... So I can just get it uploaded and get on to something else, whether that be streaming or uh, recording another episode or whatever. Uh, I actually recorded an episode last night while I was uploading. It's like, wow, look at this. I can upload and uh, and record at the same time. Who would have ever thought that's possible? So, uh, let me think of how this is going to work out. Come into here, but the bottom part is not the floor. The bottom part is not the floor. You know what I mean? Uh, this will just be a three for down here. And we'll put the five up on top. Know what I mean? You're following me. Just like we did on all the rest. more I look at this tree farm, I know I went through a lot of trouble to get it the way that it is, but uh, the, the more the more I look at it, the more I don't like it. The more I don't like the trees growing out of the building like that. Um, now, it would be cool. What would be cool is if we did bulletproof glass all the way up the height of the tree and cover the entire thing in glass. Now, that would be pretty cool. Right? That'd be pretty cool. But having the trees grow through it like that, I don't know if I'm such a fan of it. The more I look at it, the more I think it should just be a garden. And we just grow our trees out over there. Give me some feedback on that. What do you think when you look at it? Like when I'm over there standing on top of the uh, forge room and I'm giving that preview at the end of the day of the work we've done, uh, what do you think about the trees growing up out of the building like that? Is it okay? Or should I change that? Should I make it so that uh, that we just use the tree farm that's over there and grow our garden in here? 
Let's have a garden in there. Let me know what you think, because we'll change up the flooring and all of that. I'm about to change the flooring up in there anyway. Uh, I had a suggestion from... Um, boy, I, I apologize. I see so many names. I forget who made the suggestion now. It was Nick T or someone uh, about uh, changing up that flooring so uh, it, the plates make it all even looking uh, when you're looking at the... Uh, When you're looking at the dirt on the ground, you don't have that odd uh, kind of uncomfortable gap there in between. So, uh, it all matches up. It all looks good as far as I can tell. Uh, it's all centered over there. I say we nail her down. We just nail her down. Don't even think about it again. We nail it down, and if it's not right, then doggone it, we'll just do it all over again. We'll do it right. But I think this is right. I want to take a sip of my tasty beverage. Mrs. Spartan made a homemade pizza tonight for dinner. And uh, all of that uh, sodium and everything. I'm a little bit thirsty. i to take a sip of my goldenrod tea. I need to get goldenrod tea to sponsor the channel, don't we? Maybe Campbell's Chunky Beef Stew. My finger in every bite. <laughs> I don't think they would... I don't think they would buy into that. Who knows? Who knows? Maybe a finger in every bite. You never know. I apologize, Campbell. If you're listening. I know there's not. Nothing but real beef up in there. All right. Booyah! Hope I did that right. I think I did. <laughs> I think I did. All right, so next phase... Next phase would be uh, not to build yourself up into the ceiling. That would be the next phase. And do, 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 do. Now let's go over here and take a look at this real quick. So, probably should have run from underneath to look at that. You know what I mean? I'm going to move the microphone a little bit closer to me. I'm trying to save my voice a little bit because I talked so much on the stream earlier for almost four straight hours. i got to save those vocal cords just a little bit. Just a little bit. All right, so five out is right. I want to make sure... Where I place all of these blocks because I'm just going to place them and nail them. Place them and nail them. I'm not even going to hesitate once I start to placing them. Yeah, we might need to get, and that's why I got the forge over there burning in a new forge room, is to get more iron pumping out so we can make more rebar because I think I'm going to use all the rebar we have. I'll have to look and see what we have left over. I don't know. We have five full days of building between now and and the next horde day, and I'm going to try to milk the resources as long as I can without having to go mine again. I think we have enough to buy us at least a couple episodes, maybe a few, uh, without having to go and mine again. Uh, I have a decent amount of concrete saved up. Uh, the paint would be the one thing we're going to run short on. Oops. And I can I can plant a little bit more of that stuff. Matter of fact, we need to do that. You know, we need to we need to plant some more chrysanthemum and uh, goldenrod cotton uh, so we can get a bit more of that, uh, get a bit more paint going. Right, almost there, almost there. And we need to tap into this side of this building over here. Whoops. We're gonna need to tap in there and get our walkway done going through the side of the building. 
<clears throat> Someone asked me or made a comment yesterday about the flat land. How how does this guy build on these big bases on flat land? Um, you know, the seed is not all that flat. Uh, I just drive around and find a flat spot. Let's look out there. Look at the elevation, the mountains. They pretty much go all the way around. And then it, there's a valley right there. You can't see it. And there's water. And then the other side, it does the same thing. And all the way around, I have that. But I just look for a flat spot. You know, it's not that the whole map is flat. Uh, I just, I don't know if you haven't kept up with the series from the beginning. Uh, you wouldn't know it, but I drove around for a while looking for the ideal spot. And uh, I, I remember looking on the map and uh, thinking uh, that little peninsula right there, little thing that juts out, pretty cool. Looks like if you look at your map, you can see the clear area right there. And then you can see the kind of dark color area. Uh, I assume just like right here, you can tell elevation drop going down to the water. Uh, elevation drop right there. Uh, you know, you can see the mountains, um, the increase in elevation. Now, it's not totally flat. Yeah, uh, I'm making it look flat because I'm augering out all of the raised and lowered areas. But um, yeah, I just wanted to kind of clarify that. It's not like I... It's not like I magically made some super flat area or something. <laughs> I just, you know, I look for it. I search for it. I didn't just settle it, you know, the first random place that I came came across to build this big giant base. Hopefully I don't cause a cave in here. Okay. If I am not that's my guess here. We would go up to here. And put this block. Let's see if we can copy that rotation. Uh, a little something like that, right? And might as well nail this down. I'm pretty confident that we're dead spot on with this, so... Look at that. Construction tools after this big giant base. We have still not capped out construction tools. i tell you the difference though, folks. That's the difference from working on one big base versus multiple mid, small to mid-sized bases, like we did on Alpha 15. Man, we were capped in construction tools. Maybe it's a little easier on Alpha 15, too. I think 330 mentioned that. Uh, uh, level out your construction tools than it is on 16. Maybe it goes a little faster, but I, you know, with building a big base, you're doing so many other things other than just upgrading some rebar. Uh, you do that here and there like we are now, but the, you look at the time period there'll be between now and when I actually upgrade something with the nail gun in this uh, magnitude or in this volume. It'll be a while. Uh, so it's, it's funny to think I'm not even capped, but you don't need to be. It doesn't even matter. I don't think it has any kind of effect whatsoever. Uh, you have to reach... Uh, is it 40 or is it 60? Something like that is a magical number that you need to reach. Um, you know what I could have done? They would cut back on the size of the garden. But I could have... Taken these blocks out here. Made myself kind of a little pretty little walkway that goes from here to there. Or there. You know what I mean? Um, I wonder, I doubt the glass would hold up from that span over there, which is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I doubt it would, would hold that, you know, that kind of weight, uh, just being glass. But uh, still, I want your feedback. If you're still watching, I uh, thank you if you are. I want your feedback as to what I should do with these trees. Should I cut them all down and make this solely a garden 
just all garden uh, all the time or leave the trees in there what do you think what do you think would look best okay so uh walkway 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 i need to do this As well walk with my back to the edge here. Approaching the edge. I had a feeling I was getting close to the end. All right. And some of these aren't going to get upgraded, though, because remember over here in the corners, we did that uh, all glass. All glass all the time. Oh. Great thing about rebar, folks. If you goof up, you just pick it up and keep going. So I think it would have been one, two, three, four. It would have been like these four blocks and then, then those. And then this was a rounded piece on the corner. You know, one of these. Let's do a simple placement. Was it that? Oh, you didn't just do that, Spartan. Something like that. Uh, all right. I'm going to walk over to this hallway and take a look at it. Make sure we're spot on. So we need our plates on our belt. And... Son of a gun, Spartan. You did it wrong. You did it wrong. Well, that's why we don't upgrade. I'm probably going to need more of these. Why don't we go ahead and make some more corner, 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 right there. Let's do another 150 of those. Craft another 150 of those. Because we're about to use all of these up. I don't know what I was thinking, but I had the round block. I had the round blocks. So we had one, two, three, four. I hear a zombie walking around up underneath me. What's Mr. Zombie doing? And then... I'll just stick it here for now. There's a vulture flying around over there. We can always auger it out, because it's just standard concrete. It's not reinforced, so it'll only take just a few clicks of the auger. Take care of that. Something like that. And then same thing here. It's uh, not perfect. Start right there. Go on down here. Boy, I'm almost talked out for the day. I, I wanted to get at least two hours worth of recording in for um, uh, what will be Monday. Uh, so I have uh, I have almost talked myself out with that three and a half hour stream. And uh, probably a little sleepy from, uh, from eating that dinner Mrs. Spartan cooked. <laughs> Might need to go get a cup of coffee in if I'm going to record one more episode. Get all... All jacked up on Mountain Dew. That's what I need to do. All right, so now we got to figure out our lighting situation here. And I have a cool idea for the lighting or for the electricity, but I mean, it kind of follows suit with what I've done on the stream series and a few of my other bases with the uh, power poles, but uh, I, need to, I need to really think about where I'm going to put a central location for generators. I mean, I did be honest with you, with the way this base is set up now, and we have these points coming in from all directions like that. I think I goofed that up over there. Oh, it's a wandering horde. Yep, wandering horde. 
Let's just let them blast apart on these uh, spikes here for a second while I take a look at this. So you're one, two, three. Yeah, I need to take one more piece of glass out right there. Oh, he was going to get up from that. It's a tough zombie. Tough zombie! But uh, I'll show you what I was talking, what I was going to start talking about before we were interrupted there by that wandering horde. Game's always trying to distract me. You know, if it's not one of you, it's the game trying to always distract me, trying to keep me, trying to keep me from doing what I want to do, what I'm going to do. All right. Um, but what I was going to say is because we came in over here like that, and we came in over there and over there. I thought about coming out on this side. And we wouldn't have to do a long hallway. We wouldn't have to do a long hallway. Uh, it could be about the length of from here to the center. Or maybe not even that long. And we put ourselves a generator room. This just specifically for our power. For all the lighting. It'd be responsible for all the lighting in the base and all the turrets. You know, we're going to go all out and do it. We're going to go all out and do it. And... This end down here, I have other plans for it. I have other plans for it, and I don't think it would work out to do that. But this end is free. And let's take a look at the elevation. Looks like the elevation is uh, roughly the same. Goes maybe up a bit, but that's okay. We'll make it even. And uh, it doesn't matter because we're raised off the ground anyway. Uh, but that was just something I thought about the other day. I was trying to find a central location for generators. Because we failed to do that on the stream series. So you live and you learn. And we did all that building on there, and I just couldn't think of a a good place to uh, to put a centralized generator room. I ended up building it on top of the forge room on there. But uh, here, let's have our own separate wing for power. How about that? How would that be? Uh, and I could put a light right there as well. So we have one, two, three. Hmm... We'll probably end up putting some lighting in here somewhere, you know. Uh, uh, but I also have another idea for lighting in here as well. Uh, something we're going to do eventually, eventually. And uh, I, I have a creative way of how I want to feed power down to it. But I was just looking. So we went one, two, three, and then the light. And here we've not even done that yet, have we? One, two, three, and then the light. So I need to change up how we did this over here. Uh, if I want to do it right. So let's copy that rotation. No, oh, not that rotation, that rotation. So it'd be one, two, three, and then the light. Let's build our way from the... Then one, two, three, and then the light. You know what I mean? And then the light. So, uh, we couldn't do that, but that's okay. We could. We could put a light there and a light there. I think that would look good. A light there. And one, two, three. Yeah, well, that's how we did it from this side, looks like. No. We'll figure it out, though. We'll figure it out. I'll work my way back to that forge room. Uh, but just so it looks right from in here. So we went uh, one, one, two, three, and then a light. Let's copy this rotation. One, two, three, and then a light. Okay, well, let's do the same thing over there. I think that'll work out beautifully. And 
what's the next order of rotation? Yep. Uh, it doesn't work out so smoothly going this way, but I, I think it'll be all right. Just a different distance. It's just a different distance. Uh, I didn't. I didn't uh, plan on this originally. You know, uh, having the, the all the hallways from all the sides. I planned on coming from what was our old forge room to the horde bunker with a hallway then going that way and going this way. I didn't expect to have the wraparound hallways like what we have here. Uh, so I didn't plan. I didn't measure out for that at the beginning of the build. But, uh, you know, it's okay. It's going to work. It's going to work. As long as you keep things uh, odd numbers uh, all the way around, then you're good to go just like we had over here and being able to connect to it uh, with those odd numbers. So, that being said, let me get my bulletproof glass and my bullet roof glass uh, plates and curves all of that out uh, we'll copy this rotation and before I go even one block more let me take a look at this and how I did this corner uh, so we had the one there then the curved corner the one there in the curved corner uh, and then this one was directly across from it so the one there before, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, right? Four and four. Let's get that just right. Last time I didn't do that. That was the last thing we built. But this time probably should be the first thing I do. You know, probably should be the first thing I do. So let's take these blocks down. Mm -hmm. Then one, two, three, four. And that's going to be a square block right there as well. And square block right here. Okay. Uh, I think that's right. I think that is right. And then we had this in this uh, cozy little corner here. Like that. Right? And boy, you can see the tree through the glass right there. There's a zombie somewhere around. Is that a crawling zombie? A zombie that lost its legs on a cactus? I think it is. I just don't see it. And then it would be bulletproof glass. Boom, 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 boom. A boom, 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 boom. A how, 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 how. And how did we connect the glass to the corner? We made a little thing that looks like that. And we put that pretty little block up there on top. So it looked like a uh, look like that. All right. Is that how we did it? No. No, no, no. Placed it. I placed it wrong. Would be like, uh... Boy, I'm, 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 uh, fading. I'm fading fast, folks. <laughs> fading fast. Fading real fast. 
be building my way up there and look at it one more time, but I need to turn it on its side. So we had it coming in. Like. Oh, there he is. You little sucker. Stay away from my base. Grand Spartan base. How many rotations does it have? I think it's just making up rotations now. I don't think they're really in the game. We're just clicking and... Like that, right? Let me, let me go over here and look at it real fast. Refresh my memory. I know it was just like a day or two ago when I recorded and did that, but... So we had the one. So it's not going to matter what it looks like. We're going to fill it in right there. So we had the one that, that goes like that. Facing out that way. Still need to paint that little place right there too. And then the same thing for the other way. Uh, I just put the, the top on it that made it look... Um, the top on it made it curved off and look right, but... Sounds like I hear another wandering horde out there. A horde out there. There's a horde out there. All right. And we could just do simple rotation here. And might as well put the cherry on top while we're up here. I think we can reach. I think we can reach them all that way. I still doesn't feel right. Yeah, 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 that's right though, right? <sighs> Grand Spartan's been doing too much seven days to die today, folks. That's what's happening. That's what's going on. Uh, because this, this thing up here needs to change around like that. So that it looks like that. You know what I mean? This is backwards. This is wrong. Let's get it while it's wet. So if I put this on top there, would match up with uh, that way. Grand Spartan needs to get some coffee in him. That's what he needs to get. What are we at? Forty-eight minutes. My goodness, I'm fading out fast, folks. I'm, I'm kind of, I'm kind of dozing off here as I'm recording this episode. I still have one more hour to go. One more to go. Be five and a half hours to put into seven days a day. Well, really about six and a half, but who's counting, right? And then put this. Uh, Thing on top there and then we're going to run this piece just do an advanced that's it right there mm -hmm. sorry about that I really I, I was kind of I was in another world I was in another world that's that's the point right there where I'm usually if I'm playing uh, by myself, I'm on the multiplayer server. I'm like, you know what? It's it's probably time for Grand Spartan to call it a night and and get some rest. <laughs> That's the point I was just at. All right, I got it though. I'm back. I'm back. Uh, Scotty, beam me up there, folks. Scotty, beam me up. But I'm back. I'm back and recharged and ready to go. Second win. Second win. That's about the third or fourth win today. But who's counting that either? Put the 
cherry on top here. Cherry on top there. I hope I did this right. My goodness. I hear you, Screamer Lady. Got no time for you today. Grant Spartan's trying to get a little building done for these fine folk. All these fine people. And I didn't build that one up high enough. Needs to go one more. Let's get her while she's wet. I was hoping I could copy that rotation and have it the right way in one click. Not that lucky. There we go. There we go. I did get a nice message from someone, was it yesterday, talking about, you know, that they appreciate the... The attention to detail that I put in it, even though we don't agree on, you know, what looks good and what doesn't, they appreciated the detail that I put into it in the time. Uh, some of those things like that, you know, it takes a bit of extra thought for me to kind of get it the way I want to get it. But uh, anyway, so that'll be that. Uh, we'll go extra long today if we need to, but I want to make sure I get this done uh, and done right. Um, let's get our plank glass back out again. Let's copy that rotation, and that's not right. It's not going to copy that properly. Copy it properly. Properly copied. There we go. And we're going to take, uh, take that and put it right there. You right there, my friend. Might as well get these done as while we're at it. Pop those up. I always wish the blocks would magically know where I wanted to put them. You know, I wish they did. Uh, oh, we didn't do the plates on this side. So let's get these since we're done with those now for a while. Uh, and we started the block right there. Advanced. All right, we can take this and we can copy that. Mm-hmm. We stuck one in there or not. I don't know how that'll look if we do that. I don't remember if that's how we did it on the other side. We'll do it right there. We'll auger it down if it's not right. And should be no tunnels whatsoever affecting us on this one. Uh, like the last. All right. Uh, copy that rotation. Get this fine piece of glass put up in here. Oh, I didn't want to do that, though. spot oh, that's not so long that's not such a long hallway copy that rotation all right get these pretty little curve blockies up in here like a so. Let's see if I can get a nice rhythm going here so I don't have to stop. Well, you know what, folks? We might just have enough 
to finish the next hallway over there too without having to make more bulletproof curved or plates. How beautiful would that be? It's beautiful. Cannot forget to paint the concrete over there before we put the blocks in too. We're gonna grab that paint. And get my plates. Advanced placement. Click up on it. Oh, what was that? Magical floating blocks up in here, folks. You know how I don't like the floaties. Do not like the floaties. Not my cup of tea at all. All right. So that's that. Uh, we did glass all up in here, didn't we? We did glass all the way around. I think I'm missing some glass over there as well on the uh, other side. Uh, so look that way. Look that way. Let's get in the middle and look both ways. I think we came up in there like we did over there. Let's do that. All right. So, well, we did this in uh, in a good time. I, I kind of goofed up there and I spaced out a couple times, but we only need a thousand of that. Get my paintbrush on my belt. Get my paintbrush on my belt. On my belt. And don't need that in there, but this one can probably, yes. Take 18 of those out of there and 95. Oh, we made a lot of those, didn't we? Why did I make so many? Oh yeah, well we have one more corner to go as well, so uh, it only made sense to make that many. Uh, I got my paint on me. I have my, do we not have another paintbrush? Is there not another paintbrush here? Yes. That way I can have one medicine cabinet and the other one on blue. Of course, one of them's about broken, so I don't know how much we're gonna get done. I think I almost broke that thing painting all of the, uh, all the colors in here. We need to steal this out too, folks. That's something we need to do pretty soon too. I keep neglecting that, but that is something that needs to get done. Happy little brush strokes, ladies and gentlemen. Listen to the sound of the birds as we paint the concrete. Sound like a commentator for a golf match. And he's lining up for the birdie. Just a few more strokes and he'll be done. Uh-huh. Oh yeah. All right. So like I said, I need to fi figure out what I'm going to do with the plates on the side. You know, that's holding all the weight up. That's holding up everything, but I need to figure out what I'm going to do with that exactly. Say what, before I build that, let's build this. That looks pretty sharp. I just misplaced a block. Ah! That does not look sharp. Uh, but it looks pretty sharp with the blue underneath. You know, painting it first like that. That's the, uh, that's the bee's knees. I heard someone use that for the first time in a long time in a movie the other day. All right, look at that. All right, uh, so let me paint you. Well, that really shows up when you paint it, doesn't it? The uh, spots that don't get love, don't get paint. You know I love you, baby. I always want to be with you. Let's paint this down this way. Yeah, I'm not going to make you suffer through too much painting, but I, let's just finish out a little hallway here. A little bit of it, at least. We won't do the sides. 
We'll get some of this done so we can kind of see, have an idea of what she's going to look like. Um, you know, going all the way down and all the way, we'll go down this way. I do this like this. I want to run outside and get that as well. It'll take us but a minute. And I'll show you what I did uh, last time. Because uh, I didn't share that with you all, but it's a very simple thing. It's just a matter of, look, I sit right here. And I can paint way down the hallway if I want to. You don't have to, you don't have to move and paint. You can just stand in one spot and paint for long distances. Long distance information. Get me Memphis, Tennessee. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we'll have to come in here and paint all of this at some point. We'll get it, uh, let's knock it all out right now. Heck with it. I'm here. I can't paint the corn. I have blue corn. I have blue corn. All right. And get this down this way like a so. Kind of like the blue on the ceiling here. It looks all right. And let's get our black. Black and blue. That's what these zombies are when they pass through this base. We're going to get a nice little aerial view of it here in just a moment. We need to go outside and jump up top. And see what she's looking like with the additional hallway. I anticipate it looks, uh, it's looking sharp. It's looking a lot better than it did before. Uh, but we still have a lot of lighting to go to. Next time I go to the trader, we need to, uh, we need to do that. We need to buy some lighting. I'm going to probably head into town at some point, go to one of those places with all the computer components, and uh, I'll share it with you. I, I won't do that on my own because uh, it'd be a little bit of excitement added in there. You never know, have sleepers and all that. But we'll go into one of those buildings that has all the electronic components, and we'll, uh, we'll disassemble those things with the wrench. Uh, that way we can make plenty of lighting moving forward. Bet you I can paint all the way to the end from right here. You watch. Well, I told you. You go all the way to the end. Look at how far that reaches. It's like 12, 10, 12 blocks away or something. All right. Now... Yeah, really got to figure out what I'm going to do with these side walls, these plates, how I'm going to do them. I kind of like them white. You know, kind of like them white. I like the way they look. I think it's pretty sharp being white like that. Uh, we'll go over here and do it this way. Do it this way. I did it my way. Oh, wrong color. Garden. Mm-hmm. It's pretty easy now that I have the layout done. All I have to do is just, you know, paint it up. I have, uh, I have the scheme or the schematic the way I think I'd like to have it done. Now it's just a matter of following the, uh, the blueprint and what we've laid out before us. Oops. Here, I'm going to jump down in a moment. I know as soon as we jump down, we're going to have a wandering horde come by. That's going to be a uh, guarantee. A guarantee. I who used to say that. That's been a commercial I used to watch. That's a, a money back guarantee. A guarantee. <laughs> All right. Happy, happy little brush strokes.
Mm-hmm. Hi-ho, hi-ho. Off to paint we go. With a brush stroke here and a brush stroke there. Hi-ho, hi-ho, hi-ho. That's the one piece I forgot to paint on the other side, remember? I still need to paint that piece. Come on, get it right. There it is. See, it doesn't take as long as you might imagine. Now I'm running through a lot of paint. Oh, not that much paint. Not even 400 paint yet with the, both the hallways, you know. It's pretty efficient. Pretty efficient the way it, the amount of paint it takes. Uh, but look, I've done already with all of that. Uh, let me jump over here and get this other side. And turn around and... Okay, I already got that block there. But it's so nice with the reach of the paintbrush. You know I can hold my... Tasty beverage in my hand while I do it, or however I want to do it. And just stand back and one-hand it right there, just like that. It's very soothing. Very relaxing thing to do. Glad they, they incorporated this into the game. Somebody I... Uh, was talking about this one time that I kind of respected their opinion on the game at that point. And they talked so much trash about what how stupid it was that there's a screamer that you'd be able to paint on the game and what a waste of, you know, time and effort on the game and blah, 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 blah. And I thought, you know, uh, I can't wait for it myself. I think it's going to be an excellent addition to the game. Oh, you know what we need to do? We need to go back over here and pick up uh, the arch blocks. It was just this real negative rant about, you know, how bad of an idea that was. But, man, I mean, look at what I'm capable of making now. Look at that. I could never make it look like that before. It would never. It would never look like that. It would just look like this. Like this. Real uh, dungeon-esque. Or however you want to, whatever you want to call it. But it certainly wouldn't look all cool and fancy like what we have here. I couldn't have made uh, couldn't have made this or the stream series base uh, look as marvelous as they look uh, without that paint. And we'll have to figure out we're going to paint the underside. Might paint it the uh, black color as well. We'll get the roller for that. You know, we'll get the roller for that. I'm stepping in a squishy. Stepping in a squishy. Now I'm stepping on a cactus. Stepping on a cactus. Son of a gun. Cactus got me. Whoops. Well, this is going to be nice. This is going to be a nice episode. Uh, I knew it was probably pretty laid back and maybe not as entertaining. Uh, my part was not as entertaining, but... Uh, you were able to see this hallway done, corner and everything, and getting it painted from start to finish. Uh, I don't think we've covered that in an hour. Of course, we're a little over an hour now, but in an hour episode, I don't think we've been able to get something like this done before. And uh, we are today, folks. We are today. Today, we're going to paint this sucker from start to finish. There's a song in my heart, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, whoops. See right here? Look at this. I just stand here. I'm just gonna stand here. Now you know what? We need a curve block up in there. Let's do advanced placement. And clickety-click that thing into place. All right. Now I actually need to paint that from uh, oh above as well uh, to get it just right. You know what I mean? Paint this blue. I thought about painting this black. So if we had this corner right here, but I don't know. I don't know how. Let's see what it looks like if I painted it black. Nah, I don't like it as much. I don't like it quite as much as I do like this. I think that looks better. But this is a heck of a project to finish in an hour. Now, I, I wasted about 10 minutes goofing off and talking, and I didn't 
I'll probably be all the extra time over an hour was the wasted time on the episode. But up till that hour, you know, we, we, we got a lot done in just an hour. And a lot of people say, oh, how do you do this in such short time and this and that? Uh, well, you know, there you go. Uh, we just got all of that done in, in that time, uh, which I, I felt like was a, I felt like it was a lot to get done. Um, I want to give this a nice, smooth transition into the building right there, and the same over here. And give it that black there, and then we'll do the blue over here. Like that. Yeah, I don't see why I don't include you all. Uh, if I'm just going to paint a section, you know, if I'm just going to paint one section, why I don't include you all in that uh, the painting of that section. And you can say you were here for the entire project, you know, the entire uh, section that we worked on in the video. And I'm leaving it right there because we're going to redo all of that at some point. You know, I don't want to want to get too crazy. Uh, with the paint down there and then have to tear all that apart. Because that's essentially what we're going to do. We're going to tear all of that apart and move those shotgun turrets to a different location. I don't know how it's going to look quite yet. We got all the sides painted there. We sure did. There's that attack of the killer cactus again. I don't know if I've tackled this yet. I guess we just wrap on around with the... Uh, I guess. I don't know how I did the other side. I don't remember that. I don't remember doing the other side uh, with the paint. Oh, well, we want this band. Oh, I don't know how to paint. Got to run back real quick. Real quick. Well, I'll tell you what. This side done. Well, there's another level for army, uh, armor by stepping on a cactus. That's how you get your level up on armor, folks. You just stand on a cactus. Don't do what I do. Just... Appreciate what I've done, right? Before I get any more paint, we're going to call it. I'll show you. What we have done today. All right, folks. There it is. There's the new section we just got through doing. Kind of what it looks like. I think it looks pretty sharp. Uh, matches up with that side over there. Of course, I forgot to put the bulletproof glass in there. We have it now, too, uh, to match that side over there. Oh, there's a screamer way over there. Oh, I got her. I think I got her. All right, so that's what she's looking like, folks. That's what she's looking like. She's coming together. Still got some painting to do there in the corner, and then the outside, I'll grab the paint, and I'll do that. And I think in between episodes... Uh, between now and next episode, uh, I might try to do some more concrete on the ground down here. Uh, concrete all underneath there and make this this T formation or this plus symbol uh, make the concrete go over there. But that's what it's looking like, folks. She's, uh, she's coming together. I thank you for your support. You have yourselves a good day, good evening, and I will see you all next time.